It's Premier League predictor time. Paul Mariner is my challenger. It's like work dad versus work daughter. But we're going to pull it off. Mariner's Brighton against Chelsea. Well, after the absolutely dreadful performance by myself last week, I'm going to try and redeem myself. By both of us. Well, I think this is a fairly easy one. Chelsea need to get things going. They need to score goals. I go with the Chelsea W. Well, I thought it was fairly easy for Arsenal as well, but that was not the case. Absolutely. I'm going with Chelsea too, but let's get to the Gunners now. Are they going to do better this weekend, Mar we're against in, Crystal Palace? We're in, we chatted last Sunday after the after mm -hmm. the game against Bournemouth. And you were disgusted? I was disgusted. I, and I, I still am. Unless Koscielny is back, I said that the defence is poor. I think that Palace under Roy have, have really got something going. I've got to draw, mate. Ooh, Mara. I need to say it. I've got to draw. I think a draw could be a good shot, but they're back at the Emirates, Maris, and I'm going to expect Arsene Wenger to pull off something. Lord knows with all the talent that yep. seems to be leaving Arsenal in the transfer windows, yep. I would hope he would have to make a statement. Well, I saw the I. What goes on. I'm not hopeful, though. I'm going to go with them. Burnley, Man United. Uh, Burnley under Sean Dyche, just, just not quite doing it as they were at the beginning of the season. I, I, can't, see, I can't see United failing. You mean right here? Sorry, right That's how you work, dads. <laughs> I'm going to go with United as well for obvious reasons. Everton, West Brom. Does this smell like a draw? Because it does to me. This is a difficult game for me. My mate Stevie Walsh is director of football at Everton. And my other mate, John Carver, is the assistant manager at Albion. So I'm going for a draw. Oh, you're sitting <laughs> on the fence. That means I can't go for a draw. I'm going to go with Everton at Goodison Park. <laughs> Why not? Leicester Watford. Uh, again, Watford, sort of a similar story as mm. Burnley. Not quite firing as they were early on the season. Leicester, very impressed with Leicester last week against yes. uh, Chelsea. I'm going with a Leicester City win. You know what? I'm going to go with the Foxes as well. I do love me some Foxes. <laughs> I like me some Leicester City. <laughs> All right. Stoke City, Huddersfield. Oh, now, this no. is the one you're tuning in and getting this your is, popcorn this, for. This is where the <laughs> tickets are going to be flying out the, the tote's hands. Um, not overexcited about this. Can Paul Lambert get his first win? After seeing Stoke in midweek, I don't think they can. I think that um, others feel very, very well organised. I'm going to go with a draw. No, Paul Mariner, you know the draw was can my shout. I'm going for a draw as well. West Ham, Bournemouth. Uh, this is a difficult one. Um, Eddie Howe absolutely buoyed with the result against Arsenal. Then in the cup in midweek, they go out, which is a very, very poor result for them. Yeah, he changed the side. West Ham at home under Moisey, I think they've got something. Uh, I'm going with the Hammers. Do you know what? I think I'm going to go with the Hammers as well for this one. Manchester City recently having to eat a big slice of humble pie. Yep. But you would expect them to bounce back well, against Newcastle. Rafa, Rafa, if he could, he'll play uh, a back ten like he did uh, <laughs> earlier on in the season. He'll park as many shower bangs as he possibly can. Mm. For all the youngsters, that means it's a, uh, the bus. I am going with, uh, who says, all Manchester City to yep. bounce back. <laughs> well, that's what we did last week against Liverpool and didn't really quite... Pan out. Yeah, Liverpool way. were good though. Southampton, Tottenham. I mean, even though yep. they're at St. Mary's, you know, I'm going for the yep. Spurs. A absolutely, no doubt whatsoever. Harry will get, get another hat trick. Speaking of Liverpool, will the Reds continue marching on against Swansea? They most certainly will. Yep, Swansea were absolutely uh, dreadful in the league last week. Liverpool were absolutely sparkling yes. and sensational. The pool will win. Gonna go with the Reds as well. So not that much separating us, Maras, like <laughs> father, like daughter, I there suppose you, you could say that. Well, we'll see exactly who comes out on top after this weekend in the Premier League here at ESPNFC.com.